morning oh I've got a bulb out oh well I'm gonna change him sweet yard empty again isn't it <laughs> have you seen that new driver that new driver he said oh it's chaos in here said every day mate <laughs> <It must be. laughs> don't know I think he's been here about a week or two now <laughs> Morning. So we have a new driver. He's not a brand new driver. He's, he's driven before. I think he was. I don't think he did I think he was on like boxes or something like that. Box siders. Yeah, well, not box siders. You know what I mean? Box vans. Anyway, um, it's, it's chaos in here this morning. It's early morning. <laughs> so we're going to leak. Let me put my milk in the fridge first. Oh, that fridge smells a bit funky. I'll give that a clean in a bit. So yeah, just start, just starting my shift. First one of, I'm doing six days this week because I booked off last week. I booked off a couple of days last week, so I, did a, I only did a short week last week. So I said I'll do an extra one this week just to kind of make up so I don't lose any money. Uh, I mean, I get paid all pay anyway, but you know, greedy. So we're going to leak. So we've got a load of. Well, we've not got, we've not picked up the trailer yet. It's on the other side of the yard. I'm just doing you know, with everything here because it's it's busy over there. There's loads of people trying to get the trailers and and whatnot. Uh, ST thirteen seven SQ. ST thirteen seven SQ. Tissington Place. Uh, to Staffordshire. Staffordshire Dunley Farm. Well, this is going to require a Google, isn't it? I'm going to show a map on that. Because. I ain't going there until I've got I've got the location. Let's have a look. Absolutely not. <laughs> Absolutely nowhere near what my. <laughs> uh, I don't know where this place is. <sighs> I hate stuff like this. Get yourself on Google. It's the future. Right, I think I've got it now. Google and my phone both agree that it's here where I found. And it looks like a farm to me because it's just in the middle of nowhere. Ah, well, I'm looking at this farm and I'm thinking, how the hell am I going to turn around down there? It doesn't look like you can turn this trail around in that yard unless they've got a barn I can reverse into or something. Oh, well, we'll find out. I'll give them a ring before I get there. Rest until 6am. And then 6 till now, I've been messing around. Right, let's see. If we can get out of this gap, Is it, and the, it, we have to go backwards. I think because uh, I don't fancy catching those curtains. If I'm honest, ah, uh, guitar saw's moving. My wagon, my seat's been moved.
Why is that camera not on? The camera should be on when I'm in reverse. Weird. No, uh, come on, I'm going to put the indicator on. Turn right, Blackford Way, then you have reached your destination. Ah, oh, see someone's dumped a trailer there. So the trailer height for me is 15 foot 5. So I'll put that in now. So, I'm gonna go and uh, do all the usual stuff. Well, that didn't sound like a golf finish at that door, did it? Rattled. <laughs> right. Let's get going. Right. No cars followed me in today. Normally, a lot of cars follow you into the truck part, and then they get round in. They're like, "Oh crap, this ain't right." Well, that's some creative parking. Wow, just leave us with one. How packed was this last night? Literally, just leave us with one way in. Yeah, I'm just gonna grab some uh, some fuel. That there we go. There's one on the end. Everyone else forgets about this one, eh? Pump number twelve. <sighs> that was so slow. There's no lock to hold the pump open. So I mean, <laughs> my hands are wrecking. Uh, it was so slow, I got bored, I've only put 100 litres in because that's all I could be bothered waiting for. Radio's going to go nuts in a second. How much did that give me? So I've got a total of 49 gallons. Oh, that'll do for now. Right. I'm going to go and uh, grab a quaffy. Nope, nothing. I'm turning the back down here. Oh, there we go. Right, I'm gonna go and grab a coffee. Right, so, I'm gonna turn somewhere off this road, and it's probably gonna be a bit crap, if I'm honest. It's going to a farm. <laughs> it's on a hill. Let's see how it goes. I've had a look on Google, and I can't see how I'm gonna turn around on it, but, who knows? La casona. Spanish tapas. Don't really like tapas. Whoa, this road is slippy. Right, I've got the engine brake on full there. I'm going to take it off and just put it on one. Because you, believe it or not, just the engine brake, you can actually lock your wheels up and, and skid. Ashes Farm, oh, that's Ashes Farm, it's not that one. Oh, look at that hill we've got to get up. Oh, ah, oh, it looks like it's on the over the other side of this hill. Beans! Get up! Go, 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 go! Your foot is planted there, by the way.
guess the speed. Oh, we're going fast. There we do 17 now. please right it's letting me lift it gonna give it a bit of diff lock right right well I'm stuck on the hill <laughs> oh I don't know I'm laughing if lock is on, is that tag up yet? Right, and everything's just fell off the dashboard. And that's how you start an automatic. <laughs> right. I'm gonna wait for the clutch to cool down a minute. And everything just fell off the dashboard again. <laughs> right. I'm gonna to have to back up. pressure now so I'm just gonna uh, build some up back up and give it a good old run up and see if I can get up that way. I've got it in reverse because it's controlling my speed backwards. I might actually use the accelerator my foot's on the brake. Right, I'm going to give that a try. Power mode. Yes, I'm in power mode. Right, I'm gonna really have to give it a run up and see what happens. Right, manual, don't, don't change gear, don't change gear, stay in that, stay in that, stay in that. Ah, oh, for God's sake. Right, I'm in crawler. Where's crawler? Right, I'm in crawler now. Get up the cell, have
beat me. However, you've got to be careful of not burning the clutch out. So when you pass your test in the army, the first thing you do is do an off-road course. And basically I've just done what they taught me to do. I just needed to get a little bit more run up on it, which I wasn't getting. Oh, here's another f***ing lorry. Go get Mate, you're going to stop and let the uphill lorry come first. Oh, I'm going to get stuck now. I'm going to get stuck. That's it. Game over. I'm stuck on a hill again. He saw me from up there. He could have stopped. give way to anyone coming uphill, especially trucks. I'm actually in crawler gear here, but if you put it in manual mode and then keep pressing down until you get like a weird symbol. over there. It's got to be this, it can't be that, that's just a bloody farm track. Yeah, this is it. Someone's already hit that wall there by the look of it. That was close to that, that was like millimetres either side. No idea where the hell I'm supposed to turn this round. Unless it's a reversing out job, in which case uh, it's going to be fun. I 
I'm gonna stop here because I'm walked down. I'm not sure where, where it's going this. Right. <laughs> Spoke to a nice young lady and she said, uh, don't know where to go. Not like that, I mean. <laughs> Welcome to a traditional British farm where everything was made hundreds of years ago, so everything's super tight. So this is where my my floor mats get dirty now. <laughs> At least it's getting delivered now and not in winter, because coming up that hill in winter, well, I wouldn't wouldn't even try. Okay, this is a bit uh a bit sharp. Oh, get out of that mud. There's a dip, a massive dip there. My head's out the window. <laughs> I need to go on trailer, get around that building without going in this dip. Do not want to go in this dip on the right. I've got millimetres on the left. Flipping around it, yes. Is that middle axle round yet? Gotta watch the building corner on the trailer as well, don't want to rip the roof off it or destroy my trailer. Slipping into the dip. Come on, get out, get out, get out, get out, get out. Whew. Right, this tractor is in the way. Ah. Uh. Oh, farms. I know why these farms do Scott's Head in now. Nothing against the farmer or the farm itself, it's just crap. <laughs> right. I'm going to have to go and find someone out. I don't know where it wants to tip, but it won't want to be. I don't know if you can see there, beyond that tractor there, there's those like concrete things. That's what I've got on. So I'm not sure where he's going to unload me. We'll find out. Go me along this way, yeah. Yeah. All right. Yeah. No worries. Hook it up.
I am literally covered in cow shit. <sighs> Wetting my dad's off. <sighs> Yeah, everything from waist, everything from waist down is uh, it's covered in cow shit. <sighs> Must buy some trousers on the road. I'm not. I didn't bring any spares. Me, my floor is now full of cow shit. <sighs> my boots are full of cow shit. <sighs> There's a lot of swearing. I'm gonna have to edit out now. Shit. shit. <sighs> Let's go, donkey. Actually, I forgot where we're going. We are going to Bolton. Get out of here. Get that uh, tag axle lifted. Squeeze past this trail on the left. He said come up here follow it left, so uh, hopefully this is easier. I don't know. <laughs> oh, I see where it's bought us out. They nosy cows, aren't they? Sheep dog there asleep. Probably not asleep now. Probably looking at me. Ford Rangers there. I used to, I used to have a Ford Ranger. Do you know what? I wish I wouldn't have sold it. How long to the next one? An hour and 36. So that's going to be three and a half hours of driving total. And there's going to be an hour up there. So I'm not actually going to get that far south today, actually. We'll stay in third gear till we get to the top. Turn right, then turn left. 
So I'm going to keep to the right of this gate slightly and then once the cab's through, swing it left a little bit and then turn right. That way the trailer clears that post on the left. Right, left a little bit. Nothing coming, good. Now swing it. Welcome to the Pennines. After 500 yards, turn left, easy play. Right, so I've got the uh, the tag, tag axle is lifted, and uh, so the the tag axle on the trailer is lifted, and the mid lift on the unit is lifted. So it's four wheels dangling. Too bad an hour. Anything coming up? No. So, I've just said in the group chat that uh, I'm full of cash. You ready for all that puns? Here we go. Uh, sorry Luke, but that pun was just a load of shit, mate. Full of crap. <laughs> no, I disagree Martin. I disagree. Move on. Oh my god, stop milking it. Luke, you're a complete teat. Scott, did you just hear what Martin just called me? How dare he? <laughs> <laughs> Don't know what you mean, mate. Butter wouldn't melt in my mouth. Oh, I'll tell you what, mate. I mean, you're gonna have some beef. <laughs> Any more? Okay, okay. Can we, can we please stop with these cheesy puns? Ah, uh, Luke, I wouldn't put a steak on it, mate. <laughs> You'd lose. Oh my God! Uh, I see what you did there, Scott. Milk, cheese. Very amusing. <laughs> Uh, he's used the same one twice now, he's lost. <laughs> I don't lose, mate. It's very rare I lose. Medium rare. Nah, he might get a bit bloody then. I want to know is... why Jay got covered in f***ing like, shit there. There's a nursery rhyme I used to say when I was, when I was a kid. Is... Ah, those of you who watched my last video, well done. And uh, we're at the same place as we was in the last video. Right. No, he's guessing he's waiting to go on as well. Let's see what's what's up happening, boy. Oh, shots are down. No one's in there. No lorry anyway. Right, let's get it in the warehouse. Oh. 
Oh, I'm not good now. Uh, absolutely not good. The problem with doing that one is you have to cross brace each cross brace each lift. <coughs> so you're running around like a blue ass flea. You got two loaders, one one either side. So uh, yeah, then you have got your sight curtains out, and then you got to cross double cross brace the back ones. So uh, I've got some bits of a sweat on now. Anyway. I've got an hour's worth of driving before I have to have a break and I've not put in the heat shim. I think it's about an hour from here. Maybe about an hour. Ah, a driver going the other way just asked me if the M6 is still closed. I wasn't aware it was closed. Right, I've just uh, checked it's all straps and all that. It's already strapped in a weird and funky way but it's strapped I can't I can't deny it's not strapped right so everything that fell off my dashboard this morning I'm gonna put back on now change the sat nav wire into this multi point here is that yeah that's on uh, camera can go into the Thompson one Heating can go down because it's bloody boiling. Phone can go and charge. And then it's back to the yard. Pick up from the yard and then away we go. Just gonna put this in the uh, sat nav now. Uh, just finished traffic really, but it's 3.15 now, so. Mm, starting, it'll start to build now, that's for sure. Oh, uh, we appear to have a little bit of traffic. To be fair, I've stayed in this lane one and it's done me well up until this point, but now I know I have to change lanes. Because... I mean, someone just stopped over there to let a million people out. Uh, just back at the yard now. I think Eddie Stobart driving have just finished the shift. There's a lot coming from down there. I'm hoping this guy in front doesn't uh, block my trailer in that I'm collecting. Again, now I forgot which trail I'm picking up. Uh, it looks like it's not in the front row, so I'm probably going to be pulling it out of somewhere. Let's get this uh, parked. Hopefully, I can get it in there. A bit tight this yard tonight. Right, I've dropped my trailer off. Now I'm looking for a space to put a trailer that's in the way of my trailer. And I've not seen one yet. Oh well, I'm gonna get some fuel whilst I'm here. And worry about, hopefully, that another driver who's just pulled his unit out, so hopefully he's just grabbing a trailer out and then I can have the space where is this come from? Right, so that other guy is going to move another trailer so he can get the one he wants. So he's going to put that one where I've just taken this one from. Oh, for God's sake. 
<laughs> is it me? Are you dropping that? Or are you picking it up? Uh, so then, once he's moved that one, then I can put this one where's he, where his was. Once he's got the other one out. So all three drivers, myself and those other two, we've had to move at least a trailer each to get the ones we want. But by all of us doing what we're getting our own stuff, we kind of helped each other out. After he's got that one out, because the one I need is I'll have to put this where he's getting that one from, and then get mine out from this gap here on the right where I've just pulled this one out of. If that makes sense? Hopefully it does. So mine's just there on the right. Right, I can finally get this away and get my trailer out. All right, so this this one, two, three, four spaces, and then we we between us we've just created eight spaces, nine spaces actually, just for parking properly. I've literally just cleaned my window like window mirrors with the jet wash and the filthy <laughs> within two minutes. Bit of pride in your parking. There you go. I'm directly. I'm almost directly behind the, in front of the one behind. Someone can get another one out the side of it and then someone's probably just going to dump one in the front to be honest, that's what usually happens. And yeah, somebody didn't drop it high. Is we find out if we've got the right spot. Oh, we've missed it. Got it. Oh, finally got the trailer on. Just gonna quickly change the height marker. Do you know what? I've just changed the height marker. Now I've just guessed, double guessed myself. Was it 14.9 or was it 15.3? 14, <laughs> 14.10 it was. Good job, double checked. I'm warm. What time is it? 
6 p.m. Right, so the first drop is Hereford, then Fairford. So Hereford is uh, in Herefordshire. Fairford is in Gloucestershire. Cello, that's near Farrington. They're quite particular about the time they receive theirs then. Uh, then Bristol, Keysham, Somerset, Bristol, Somerset. So they're not too far from each other. BS 37 and BS 31. How many drops have we got in total then? One, two, three, four, five drops. Right, I'm putting the first one, which is a juicing boost code. Right, I've just had a 15 minute break, and in that 15 minutes, traffic traffic has gone up by 40 minutes. <laughs> oh joy. Yeah, so.